Better yet for your friends and them I really wanna know you all I really wanna show you off Fuck that, pour up plenty of champagne Cold nights when you curse this name You called up your girlfriends and y'all curled in that little bitty range I heard that she was Hey my divine babies, welcome back to another video. This video is a part of my back to school series. Today we'll be doing a back to school haul. Basically, most of the stuff that I got for back to school. So let's get into it. First thing that we're going to talk about is shoes. I only have two pairs of shoes right now because the shoes I wanted to get, they didn't have my size and I wasn't willing to get like any other shoe. The first thing that I got was Crocs. These Crocs are just regular black Crocs. Just regular black Crocs. I just needed a new pair of Crocs. So I was like, you know what? Let me get me some Crocs. I got the little charms from somebody that was selling it on the street. So I can't really give y'all like a website. But I can link the Crocs. Which you can find them basically at Journeys. Things like that. I'm going to just link it in my bio description. So the next shoe that I got was the New Balances 530s. I got these from Champs because Champs was the only, like these, this was the only shoe that they had in my size and this was the only, like that was the only shoe store that I could find in person that had it in my size and I really needed shoes for back to school so I just settled with these. They're actually really cute. Alright my divine babies, the next thing we're going to get into is the bags that I got. So the bag that I got for school is literally a nike elite i was gonna get a spray ground but spray ground was sold out so i just wanted to let people know if you got a spray ground just know you're very lucky like you're really really lucky like if you got a hold of a spray ground book bag you're lucky i got a black nike elite this was 85 dollars and i got this from the nike website literally i was glad i thought nike was not gonna be stocked up but nike was actually stocked up and it also has like a few compartments that I could put my stuff in. The next bag that I got was from Walmart. It's this just regular clear bag. I'm probably going to use this as my crossbody bag if I bring like another bag to school, which I probably will for the first week. And then after, I probably may not because that will probably be irritating for me to be bringing two bags to school when I literally each have that bag. But this is literally my just my crossbody bag all right my divine babies the next thing we're gonna get into is the clothes that i got so i wear uniform so technically like i literally just had to buy uniform people say you're lucky when you go to a uniform school and you're also lucky when you go to a non-uniform school but they both cost money like in total all of this was 200 dollars just for some uniform and if I got more shorts, it would have been more expensive. So, it's not really cheap, the way people make it seem like. I also got a skirt. The skirt was $24. I got a skirt because, like, I wanted to wear a skirt during the summertime until it's winter. That's when I'm going to start wearing pants. That was my plan. And then when it's winter time, it gets cold in my school. So, like, I also got sweaters, school sweater and sweaters. And I also have like little like ways to style it. And I'm not really planning on wearing uniform for long because like they have this thing called stepping up at my school. Like it's basically a privilege, a privilege if you got like a 3.5 GPA or over it. I had it before when I was in my school, but then I left. And then by the time I couldn't get on my grind and show these girls that I could really do it for it. So I didn't get it, but I wasn't really expecting to get it anyways because I joined school like mid-year like when school was about to be over but I know this year I'm gonna have I'm gonna get it and I'm gonna buy some clothes like so I could wear for the rest of the school year and I'm gonna do a haul on that too because I already know I'm gonna get it because I'm that girl but yeah all right my divine babies the next thing we're gonna get into is the packages that I got I got a few packages um this is just some of them basically all of this like the stuff that I have right now are basically like my nail stuff because I've been doing my nails by myself. This I've been had it. It's just like it's BTR box French tip nails. I think I I don't know if I ever showed them on my channel, but this is how it looks. This is how it looks. That's basically it's basically pink French tip. They have different types, and like I had ordered more of their nails and I ordered like 
other things that I needed. I had ordered like other things I needed to make my nail application better because my nail application was good, but I wanted it to be able to stay on longer. So I got a gel, like a mini nail gel, not like the little professional ones because not a professional. And then I got a cuticle pusher and then a cuticle cutter. Let me show y'all how it looks. I'm gonna link all of them down below. This is how it looks. I got a cuticle pusher. And I think I also got that thing where they use, like they use it to take out the gunk and stuff. I also got nail glue. This is the nail lid. I heard about this glue too on TikTok. They said it's really strong. So I wanted to try something that was stronger than Kiss nail glue. People was also like, the one that was really, really going viral on TikTok was the Beauty Secrets. But people were overcharging for it. Beauty Secrets is supposed to be 2 or $4. But they don't sell that at my beauty, at my local beauty supply store. It's supposed to be 2 or $4. It's not supposed to be any of that and the resellers I was selling it was selling it for ten dollars ten dollars for one bottle I never paid ten dollars for nail glue a day in my life but in this one I have rhinestone glue because I'm also going to start designing my french tips me oh it's both over here like that let me take it off for y'all but this is how it looks it's black I also got charms with it, but the charms is not coming back until I get back in school, which is kind of weird to me. But I think it may have came in, so let me check. At least y'all, it's not here. It says it's arriving August 15th to August 27th. I don't know what's taking it so long for charms to come in, but if y'all can see it, that's how the charms look. Um, and then I also got more French tips, um, but these are the short brown ones because last time I had the pink one so I wanted to try how the brown ones will look on my skin color because I'm dark skin so this is how they look but that's all what I got for Amazon packages for now all right my divine baby so now we're gonna get into like the extra things that I got for back to school see I only got a few extra things I got this wallet because I just need a like I need a wallet I got this wallet from Walmart when I went to Florida. It's a blue wallet. Y'all can't tell me that my Cash App card is not cute. I wanna show y'all, like, it's so cute. So cute, like, oh my Lord. Y'all see that, it's, like, it's so cute. Um, and then the next thing I got was a screen protector. This is a glass dark screen protector and then another extra thing that i got was a label printer i got this label printer from amazon i could also link that but i got this label printer from amazon so i could label my book bag like at the back because i don't want my book bag getting mixed up with other people's book bag because a lot of people are getting this the same book bag that i have for back to school so I need to write my name on it so it don't get mixed up just in case like we for instance we go on a school trip and we all have to put our bags in one room and then everybody got a Nike Elite and everybody know where they put their stuff I could just find my name and then another thing that I got was an Apple magnet safe and a power bank this power bank I had last year I didn't have this magnet safe last year sometimes my phone dies and this just comes to save the day then I also got a Sony ZV-1 extra battery all right my divine babies so next thing that we're going to get into is school supplies the first thing that I got was a binder I got a binder because like I be needing to like put my stuff in here I may not take these to school with me like some of these stuff that I'm showing I may not take to school with me because I could just put it in when I'm at home. And I also got this. I got a folder or whatever and I also got like a few other stuff, pencils, like basic stuff. Just like regular smuggler stuff, like notebooks. So cute. pencils, postage, sharpies. If you want to see everything that I got, you should go and check out my back to school haul. But 
I just got highlighters, posted, sharpies, and pencil cases. I mean, and mechanical pencils and pencil lead. All right, my babies. So now we're going to hop into the hygiene things that I got. So I got an emergency kit. This will be going in my bag. One of the stuff, like, these are the things I got for heating. These are heating pads. I got an emergency kit. Um, it got, like, all of my girly products in there. So if you want to also see everything that I got in this bag, you should also go and check out my emergency kit video. But, like, I got just, just basic girl stuff in here. Like, the things that you would need. If you want to know everything that you would need as a girl, and that's in this bag go check out my video first thing that i got for my hair is edge control this is Bastion ladders edge control and i also got the pink edge booster these two i already had this edge booster so i'm gonna just put it in my bag when i need to use it because most likely my edges is always done so i would probably not need this unless i'm trying to touch up my edges and then i had this last year and it works amazing like let me show y'all all right, I zoomed in as far as I can, but y'all see that? It's not moving, and I'm not even, like, promoting them. So now I'm going to show y'all all of the perfumes I got. Well, these are not all of the perfumes I got. I also got more perfumes, but I have a whole big pot. Like, if you watch my hygiene video, you know what I'm talking about. I have a whole big box of perfumes. These are just the scents I'll be using for the year, but the first one that I got was from Freshy. It is their solar flare. It smells amazing. It smells amazing. I know y'all can smell it. it. Smells like cherry blossoms. No, it doesn't. It doesn't smell like cherry blossoms. I just wanted to say that. But then I got Berlin Burgenton. I was about to say Burlington. Burgenton is from Bath and Body Works. And then I got into the night. I think Burgenton is like an it's been here for a while and they just have like a new packaging for it but this one is actually a new scent that they have it's called musk i really like it. it's must or not must muck musk like i don't know how to pronounce it but it's m-u-s-k that's how I say it. it just smells like perfume not even body mist because these are body mist perfume vibe like it just gives you that girl and then next thing i got was oils um i'm a perfume oil girl more than i am body mist i used to be such a body mist girly but now i don't know like i'm a perfume oil girly i'm both but mostly perfume oil because they last way longer first thing we're going to talk about is all the body washes that i have so i got this body wash this is for like when I want to smell good, but this is the Dove Coconut and Cocoa Butters body wash. Um, it smells really good. I wouldn't say, I'm not going to lie, I wouldn't say it lasts long on my body like when I get out the shower I can smell it. But what I can say is if you want something that you can smell when you walk out the shower like you still smell it on your body like sniff your skin and still smell it i recommend you getting the method body wash and then i got the wild magistar vanilla i got this during the bath and body work so as you can quite tell i've been using it for the past few days i actually never buy bath and body works um body washes but it was something about that body wash like it just Ugh, like it was something about it another thing that i got for body wash and that i use it at night is the kojic acid soap for this bottle it's 15 dollars at least at least y'all and then it comes with three of these and it's just an orange soap it helps with like let's say you're you have like dark dark marks dark under armpits eczema it helps stuff like that so I use it at night. And then the next thing I got was the turmeric soap bar. It's already open. This is literally my backup for when I don't have kojic acid soap. So that's why it's literally like that. Because I didn't have this for a few days. 
so I had to use this. And then I only got like a body scrub. I only got one body scrub because I already have some at home. But that is it for body washes. So now we're going to get into lotion. The first thing that I got is African Shea Butter. Like African Shea Butter is tea. Like if you don't have this in your regimen, what are you doing? Wait, this, this right here, like this, game changer. I don't even gotta say too much. Just now, get it. If you want, if you if you love moisture and you don't love being ashy, get it. If you have eczema, get it. Suffer with dry skin, get it. In the morning, I always go in with like a smell good lotion. Um, this is vanilla cashmere. I don't know why I want to smell it right now, but I just want to smell it. I already know how it smells. It smells amazing. And most of the times I be into vanilla scents. Even like the Bath and Body Works. Um, these two actually pair great together. Even though it's like on the stronger side when it comes to scents. Now we're going to get into skincare. So for skincare, I got the Aztecs Clay Mask. I restocked on that. And then Black Girl Sunscreen. And I use my Shea Butter for moisturizer and I wash my face with the Kojic acid soap too so that's literally it for my face the last thing that I also got for back to school was jewelry I got these earrings these chains I'm already wearing them but like I got these chains my Pandora bracelet always been with me for like three years now but that's a powder school jewelry this is not new though but these two are I got these bangles and then I also got a Cartier love bracelet and I also got this chain too. And I also got these earrings. I don't like them. But they're silver. I'm a gold girl for life. So yeah. But that's all of the things that I got for back to school. So this will be the end of today's video. If you like this video, like, comment, and subscribe. Go check out one of my other videos before you leave. Go click on another video and watch. So Without any further ado, I will see y'all next time. Love y'all. But I'll be on it always.